Hello, welcome to this video. It's Lena Tech from datalena.com and in today's video tutorial, I'm going to share with you a simple trading strategy that can guarantee you between 70 to 85 percent win rate. If you want to become a day trader, um, then this strategy that I'm going to show you is best for you. If you want to learn how to trade and make profit from, you know, the crypto market, how to trade features, then this strategy is the best for you. So we are going to use only one indicator and trading on the 15 minutes time frame to be able to actually take you know the advantages of the signal that this indicator is giving to us and be able to profit from the market so if you are new to my channel and you love videos about making money online about crypto trading and investing then consider subscribing hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published and if you're already a subscriber if you're already a member of this community welcome back if you have any question or you're stuck with anything you can always use the comment section and if you want to learn more about crypto you want to join our daily zoom meetings via telegram where we will post the link then link to join the telegram group will be in the video description so with that being said we need a trading view account and that trading view is what we're going to be using for this technical analysis so once you log into your trading view account what you want to do is to um, come in here so i'm just going to add the indicator we're using and then I explain to you how to be able to use that indicator so if I come in here to the indicator option here I'll go ahead and click on this and the indicator we want to add to our chart is called big snapper so I just go ahead and type in big snapper here all right so once I type in big you will see this first indicator that pops up here already I favorite this already so this will be my favorite um, it is this big snapper alert r2.0 by just uncle as you can see here just uncle if you want to know more about this indicator you can go ahead and click on you know this read more option and you know more about this indicator you can learn more from this read more option here so i just go ahead and click it to add it up to our chart and once i add it up to our chart this is how the indicator looks this is how it looks on our chart okay so whenever you see a green signal here um you go ahead and take a buy and whenever you see a red signal you go ahead and take a shot you go ahead and shot the market okay um but my um my concern here is to uh, how to scalp the crypto market with this indicator okay yeah when using this indicator on a higher time frame it favors you more because um it gives you more you know signals um the signals on the higher time frame are more accurate than using it on a, a shorter time frame okay that is why i prefer to use it either on the 15 minutes time frame the 30 minutes time frame or the one hour time frame so basically what i'm going to show you if you want to become a day trader if you want to scalp the market then always use this indicator on a 15 minutes time frame you can try it on the five minutes time frame if it works for you fine but i use it um in all of my back testing it has worked for me more on the 15 minute time frame that is why i'm actually emphasizing that i use it on the 15 minutes time frame before i go ahead and show you how to actually use this indicator this indicator comes with a lot of uh, moving averages so what i'm going to do um, all I need is just this red and you know green bar. These are just the signals that I need. These are all I need in this indicator. So what I need to do is if I hover over the indicator, I'll go ahead and click on this setting icon here. So once I click on the setting icon, I'll make sure that I remove all of these lines. Okay. I'm going to remove all of these lines. So the first one is a colored MA. If I click on it, you see that that line goes off. And the second is a 5 MA, it goes up, the medium MA goes up, and then the slow MA goes up. So uh, basically that is all you need to do to this indicator. There are no more settings, um, just leave it the way it is after. You can use the lines, you can use the moving averages if you want, but I don't want them, that is why I had to remove them, okay? So if I do that, the next thing is to go back to my lower time frame for scalping the market. So this is how it looks, and you want to make sure that you actually minimize um so you want to make sure that you expand your chart okay to be able to see the signal clearly you want to make sure that you expand the chart to be able to see um, this chart clearly okay um so as it is right now it is not all of the signals that you're going to be taking okay it is not all the signal that you're going to be taking and if you want to be sure about this um, once you see a green signal for instance you see a green signal on a green candle um what i normally do is i'll have to wait when the candle closes and the next candle opens as a green candle i'll go ahead and take you know a buy 
and when you see this signal for instance if you see a green signal on the red candle please ignore that and um, if you see for instance here this one here if you see a red signal here on a green candle ignore that as well and if you see a green uh, signal on a green um, on a red candle if you see a red signal on a green candle please ignore and if you see a green signal on a red candle equally in your dad as well so you want to always you know um, go for instance this is a red signal on a green candle ignore that signal this one doesn't work okay so what you want to do as i said earlier this work on a higher time frame but if you want to scalp the market always go with the 15 minutes and you'll be sure that you can make profit from it okay so we got a multiple signals here we got multiple signals here what i do is um, um another thing i can do here is to use the moving average and so if i go ahead i added moving average already so if i go ahead and put this on and this is the 200 um, moving average this is what is 32 the 200 and this is my trend line actually this is my I, I use this to determine the movement of the market so what i do with the moving average is that whenever these candlesticks are trading above this moving average this 200 moving average i'm always looking for a buy you know for a green candle to go long and whenever they are trading below the moving average here yeah, whenever these candlesticks are trading below the moving average i am always looking for red candles to go short in the market okay so this is how you basically use this indicator um you go ahead for instance if i wanted to take this trade here yeah, here um where we see a green signal as you can see here yeah, this this red signal sorry where we saw a red signal here yeah, we have a red signal somewhere around here so here where you see this red signal it came on a red candle and then the next candle became red as well so if i want to for instance short this market what i normally do is um because of the shorter time frame i don't you don't be greedy in the market okay so that you don't get to you know lose money here so what i do is my take profit and stop loss are always um, um 0 0.5 my take profit will be 0 0.5 and my stop loss will be at um you know 0 0.4 so if i enter this market let's say we went ahead and shot this market somewhere here so let me expand this so let me assume that our entry point is somewhere around here okay that is our entry point so my take profit will be at um, 0 0.5 all right so if i have entered this market somewhere around here okay my take profit will be at 0 0.5 okay 0 0.5 this is how i take profit and this works for me because i trade with a very high leverage okay um, anything from 50x and above that is what i trade with and if i'm making 0 0.5 on the price movement i am sure that i'm going to make <laughs> in a reasonable amount of money from there and then my stop loss will always be at zero you know 0.4 and this is a one to two reward ratio okay this is a one to two reward ratio so this would have played out okay if i've entered this market here yeah, this would have played out and if i look for another short option here yeah, let's say this is another signal we saw here um this is a red candle this is actually on a red candle that means here we would have waited um for a longer time to actually take profit okay so we would have waited longer than we expected so the signal candle here was red though the next one was actually green but it doesn't mean we would have entered this market here and would have still made profit okay so you see that this would have played that somewhere around there and if i go ahead and look for an opportunity okay this is where it crosses okay this actually crosses from here this is where we started um you know seeing opportunity to long the market and the next green candle actually traded above this moving average line here so if i have long this market it means that i would have waited for this other signal to pop up before i would have made profit from this uh, market okay so if i bring in my long um position two here and let's say we enter this market somewhere around there so we would have equally measured our take profit to be at 0 0.5 
So here our take profit would have been at 0.5 again and then our stop loss would be at 0.4. So for us to have made profit from this market, if we have entered here, that means the market would have traded to the next signal, to the candle before the next signal and this would have played out okay. So we would have waited a bit longer and when we saw this one, we would have taken this again and this would have been, you know, in profit for us and something here this would have equally played out as well and so on so basically this um this is just the strategy once again i use the moving average line and i set it once i add the moving average i will change the number just coming here to the setting by default it is um the input here is always nine so change it to 200 and i use this to determine the trend of the market if the market is in an upward trend or a downward trend and to determine that is that it means that when the candles are trading above the moving average we are in an upward trend and when it's trading this is on the 15 minutes time frame okay this applies to any other time frame you you are trading with if it is trading if these candlesticks are trading below um, this moving average here it means that we're in a downtrend so we always look for an opportunity to short the market okay and then this um big snapper indicator is our signal indicator whenever we see green here we'll go ahead and take a long signal and when we see red we'll go ahead and take a short signal so basically this is how you use this signal and i am very sure that if you apply all that i've showed you here you'll be making profit you know trading with this particular signal i love this signal i've been using it for a while now and it has you know made a lot for me so i decided to share with you and one thing i want to let you know that when it comes to crypto trading there is no one particular strategy that you can actually hold on to okay so make sure that you always test run um, or back test some of this strategy you can do that with a demo account um, or you just go ahead and implement it if you already um, if you have already been trading once you understand the signal you can go ahead and implement it and some of the exchange I recommend you can trade with you can go ahead and sign up for Bybit account okay you can sign up for Bybit and I'm um, signing up with the link I provide in the video description you stand the chance to gain up to 3500 on your first deposit okay and you know another exchange i recommend is binance you can equally sign up for binance and then OKS. so if you want to start trading features you trade with some of these exchanges that i've mentioned i'll leave links to all of the recommended exchanges in the video description and you are sure because of their low fee that you'll be able to make you know the best out of the market so that is all i have for you in today's video if you have gained value from this video give it a thumbs up so that others can equally share from this knowledge and if you are stuck with anything okay you can always ask and um, use the comment section to ask a question and once again join the telegram group to be able to join a zoom meeting where you get to ask me questions and i get to provide answers for you that is all i have for you in this video and i'll see you guys in the next video okay